Hi and welcome to Simply Scuba. In this advice video we're going to demonstrate a couple ways on how to deploy a delayed surface marker buoy using a spool reel. Okay so first of all you have to signal to your buddy that you're okay and ready to deploy your SMB by using these hand signals. Get out your SMB. Get out your reel. And the first thing you need to do is attach your reel to your SMB. So first of all, unravel your SMB a little bit just so you can get that bottom line. With your finger spool, take out the double-ended bolt snap and secure that onto a D-ring. Make sure it's secure so it doesn't fall off. Pull out the first end of the, uh, the reel just so that you've got the leader. Pass it through your hands and pass the reel through the webbing of the SMB and then back through the leader. That produces a nice secure knot so your reel is attached to your SMB. Unravel the SMB and take your time. Just organize everything, keep it away from your body because line around your body just tends to snag. Secure your alternate air source, make sure it works and place it on the underside, inside of your DSMB. Give it a small puff of air just to um, put some air in and then fully inflate it and let it go. After it's shot up to the surface, keep hold of your reel, grab your double-ended bolt snap, attach it to the line, pull it nice and tight and then attach it to your reel and that should hold it in the correct position. Resecure your alternate air source and then grab hold of your reel and you're ready to do your safety stop. And those are a couple ways that you can deploy your delayed surface marker buoy using a finger spool. It's always best to practice in a control environment like a swimming pool before you go to the open water environment. And it's always best to learn with an instructor present so that they can teach you hands on exactly how to deploy your SMB. For more information, please go to our website, simplyscuba.com. And for more of our advice videos, please go to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.